have four core modules. The first one being foundations in business analytics. And that comprises of the basic statistical techniques that you require in order to solve business problems. Uh, it covers topics such as visual analysis, exploring data, how do you find relationships between different variables, as well as how do you actually do simple linear regression models so that you're able to make predictions. Um, the second core module is the advanced analytics module and there we actually focus on predictive models. So in any kind of company you actually require to make predictions in order to be proactive in your decision making. And the models that we look at is logistic regression which can likely help you predict who's likely to be fraud. Uh, we also do models like churn where we use decision trees which help our clients better understand which customers are likely to lead them and then we do models like neural networks which help uh, financial advisors understand whether the stock price is likely to go up or down. Um, our third core module that we teach is data analytics and in the data analytics we look more at preparing the data. So in business analytics we have a business analytics process where we start with what is the business problem. From there we look at which data is relevant to teach that business problem, to solve that business problem. And then we go into exploring the data where we look at different relationships, we compare different groups, and we try and get some insights. And using those insights, we then use those, that information to build our predictive models. So our data analytics model is all about preparing our data, cleaning our data, transforming different variables that will actually be relevant and helping us to solve our problems. Um, the fourth module is optimization and decision making and there it's all about how do we maximize profit due to certain constraints. Constraints could be something as the labor, could be a constraint due to the storage and we sometimes also look at problems where we need to minimize costs subject to a couple of constraints and we apply different uh, methods such as the simplex method uh, which is a linear programming method. We sometimes look at problems where we need to look at transportation problems. If we want to empty ATM, for example, we want to understand what is the best way. Do we go to bank A, then bank B, then bank C? Or do we empty the ATMs going first to bank C, and then bank B, and then bank A? So these are the types of networks that we analyze to ensure that we do the job in the shortest time and the most appropriate time.